Mr. Ram Kumar. Yes, sir. Uh, congratulations on securing All India Rank Five with electrical Thank engineering you, in engineering yes, service sir. exam 2025. Please Thank brief you, sir, about sir. yourself, Mr. Ram. Uh, sir, my name is Ram Kumar. I completed my graduations uh, in electrical engineering from Motilal Nehru National Institute of Technology, Lahore, in 2020. I am from Dhanba, Jharkhand. Mm. Currently, I am working in as the assistant director in Central Electricity Authority. Central Electricity Authority. It's uh, through yes, Genesis sir. exam 2020? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. 2020. Okay. What motivated you to take pain to write a 2025 exam once again? <laughs> sir, everyone knows Railways. Uh, Indian Railways only. Yes, sir. Okay. Indian Railways Management Service. Uh, yes. You had already put up five years of service, na? Yes, sir. Means uh, you got already one promotion also there. I uh, no, sir. No, no, sir. Currently, I am in a CPS Group B only. Acha, 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 Group B. Okay, okay. So coming to your uh, preparation, yes, general studies of prelims, general studies yes, of prelims. Sir. Which topics you focus yes, more? Sir, I try to focus more from this study portion of the GS because uh -huh. reach, read each and everything from the dynamic portions. So uh -huh. I cover first the static portion like engineering, mathematics, aptitudes and reasoning portions, material science, ethics, ethics. project management, standard and quality. Uh -huh. Yes, sir, ethics. Ethics, ethics also. Mm -hmm. Okay. So current affairs is a, a dynamic one. It's a I dynamic do. one. No one predicts from where the UPSC is asked question from the current affairs. So, uh, it's very dynamic in nature. So, have you tried for current affairs questions also? No, sir. I leave it uh, actually. Uh, uh, so in current affairs, also, the many topics asked from the uh, static portion of the economics terms and current. Oh, so, okay, I read right. only the a, a static portion of the economic. Static part. Okay. So, yes. coming to technical paper, uh, prelims. Uh, yes. Sir. Uh, uh, what is your preparation study? Because paper will be lengthy. Time may be sufficient or may not be sufficient. How you have attempted in the exam hall? So from, from, the, from the prelims point of view, in prelims, uh, we have given that three hours and we have to solve 150 questions. Yes. So speed and the accuracy both are important. Mm -hmm. And to improve the speed and the accuracy, we have to must, must practice a large number of questions, especially right. from the PYQ. When we solve the PIQ, we analyze what types of questions UPSC generally asked. Mm -hmm. And uh, for improving the accuracy and speed, I joined the offline thesis of the ACE Academy. Okay. And by each, after every test, I analyze the mistake. What are the mistakes I have done? And I try to improve after every test. How many questions you attempted out of 150 in uh, object to technical paper? Uh, so in, uh, in uh, this year, I I think 145 questions. I have oh my God. 145 is not a, <laughs> is a great achievement. Okay. Anyway, coming to the main paper, subject to papers. Okay. So preparation yes. style is a little different compared to object to and subject to papers. Mm -hmm. And so, means. Yes, yes. What is your preparation strategy for subject to papers? In means, actually, it means uh, UPSC is your core, core and the fundamental concepts. So mm -hmm. we should very clear from the fundamental point of view of the core subject like electrical machines, power system, power electronics. And we more focus on the subject with our, which are more scoring subjects like control systems, network and theory. And for improving the uh, accuracy in the means, we have to solve questions like uh, in a subjective ways. Like we have to practice the questions uh, in, to write each and every stage that we have to write in the examination halls. Mm. So for the means also, I have joined the offline series of the S Academy and practice the questions like uh, exams, examination all day, what we have to write in the exams. What are your favorite subjects? In this in way, I have managed the time. Favorite subjects in electrical? Electrical machines, sir. Machines. <laughs> Power systems? Electrical machines, sir. Okay. Uh, other than machines? Awesome also in the, my second time. Okay. Okay. So now coming to, the, coming to the interview part, how much time 
uh, yes, you have spent in the interview board. I think, sir, it is. I think, sir, it is around twenty minutes. Twenty minutes. Okay, reasonably good. Any questions about uh, yes, your personal means a name of uh, your state, place of birth, etc. Any questions? Ah, uh, as actually, sir, this chairman chairman asks a question from Delhi that I. It's been Delhi from three and a half years, so they are social from Delhi also. Means sir, it respect to pollution in Delhi. And from the how? It respect to pollution. Yes, yes, sir. That is no. Delhi? It is the uh, yes, yes, a pollution related to pollution only. Related to pollution. Okay. Any questions on uh, hobbies? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. This year the uh, chairman for the electrical is the Sanjay Verma sir. They ask, uh -huh. I think, uh, from every candidate from the hobbies hobbies question. Because you are working in Central Electricity Authority, any questions related to your department? Yes. Yes, a technical member asks from the department only. My whole interviews goes in the power sectors of the India only. Achha, Not power from the coastal chain. Yeah. Uh -huh. So any question related to green energy, etc. Yes, questions on green energy. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Question related from the solar policies. Uh, yes, a solar policies uh, module manufacturing. Tariff calculations. Okay. Okay, Mr. Ram Kumar, uh, what is your suggestion to a B.Tech student pursuing electrical engineering second year or third year or final year? Sir, I would like to say uh, for starting the engineering services, we should first uh, analyze the syllabus and go through the okay. syllabus. Yeah. First. Understand the syllabus. Uh, then after, uh, yes, I understand the syllabus first. Because you basically ask question from the syllabus only, not out of the syllabus. Mm -hmm. And after, after analyzing the syllabus, we sh we start to to we generally start from the we to build up the fundamental concept of the core subjects like core subject from the machines, power system, power electronics. We have to use, and after build up the core subject, we also read the standard books. And try to solve the question from the standard books also because you can see generally direct question from the standard books. Okay. And have you prepared any after... micro notes? Micro notes are short notes. Yes, sir, yes, sir, yes, sir. Yes, yes, sir. Short notes is very important for the for the revision purpose. Okay. Short notes and the formula formula books also. Mm -hmm. Any other suggestions for freshers means uh, those who are studying VTech, any more suggestions from your side? Sir, main suggestion is the uh, in UPSC we have to consistent. Consistent Cons is the main factor for the selections. Huh. If, if you are not consistent and uh, not fundamentally clear, then I think the selection is not possible. See, nowadays uh, electrical engineering no takers in India, yes. similar to mechanical and civil. So what is your advice, whether uh, electrical engineering will have a future? But yes, sir, yes, sir. definitely yeah. electrical engineering has a future. Yes, mm -hmm. sir, sorry, sir. What about the job opportunities, etc.? Whether, it, suppose somebody completes a B.Tech electrical, yes. he is more worried about the placement. Yes, uh, what is your opinion about uh, job opportunities for electrical engineering students? Now, currently also, in future also, there are many job opportunities for the electrical engineer, especially the in the power sector scenario. The power sector of the country also and the old world also is the changing and changing in the very than a fast rate. Like the we are moving toward the renewable sectors. In the renewable sector also, electrical engineer is very vast for major roles. Mm -hmm. And the green energy also, clean energy oh. also. Mm -hmm. In all the sectors, electrical engineer is has major roles. Anyway, Mr. Ram Kumar, congratulations once again. Okay, convey our uh, pronouns to your parents. Okay, thank you. All the best. God bless you. Okay, thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you, sir.